Welcome to 2016 Time on the Water TV. This year is completely different. We're working with the cast crew this year who did all our film and editing work. The show has a whole new look to it. We stuck close to home, filmed a lot of new locations that aren't far from Chicago. We also filmed with a Bassmaster Classic champion and a Stanley Cup champion. Again, this year is going to be exciting, a lot of really neat stuff. Hang on because it's going to be cool. one of the year little dude probably almost a keeper throwing a little TN 70 just a little baby I hope that's a good sign though throwing a rattling bait uh, we're on Long Lake which is in Lake County Illinois waters 59 degrees so it's perfect pre-spawn never been here before it's not a big lake just 300 and something acres but I hear good things, so we're going to give it a shot. He slammed it. See, I can still catch at least one. There's one. There's another little dude. Same size as the last one. We're just going around the lake trying to figure it out little baby. Uh, with the water 58 degrees, they could be shallow, deep, don't know yet. So uh, we've only been fishing about 15 minutes. That's two. Hopefully we figure out where the bigger ones are, or by the end of the day, the bigger ones have moved in. Here's one fish. Well, a hair bigger. Well, that's a good way to get hooked. Oops, sorry, dude. There we go. Just a hair bigger. We're still looking for the bigger females, but she hit it right. Was just on it. Well, they, well, we didn't miss a big one yet, so we're cool. At least I know they'll hit this trap if you, if they can see it. it it's weedier than you think.
Introducing the all new Alda Baron, the next step in the evolution of lightweight compact bait casting reels. Alda Baron features a magnesium frame and CI4 Plus side plate construction that delivers unparalleled strength to weight ratio. X-Ship gear system supports precision gear alignment for durability and delivers an ultra smooth feel during retrieve. The precise adjustability of the SVS Infinity Braking System allows you to quickly tune your reel to any fishing condition. Silent Tune and the S3D Spool deliver smooth and efficient casting performance. Weighing a mere 4.7 ounces, Aldebaran packs performance and durability in a compact, low-profile design. For more information, visit fish.shimano.com. New trolling motor? Yep. Can I touch it? I wouldn't. Minkota Fortrex, now with 112 pounds of thrust and a restraining order. You've been warned. There's no better way to haul your fishing gear to and from the lake than in a legendary Ram 1500. And you'll find the best quality pricing and service only at the equally legendary Bettenhausen Dodge Ram in Tinley Park. You'll be hooked on the power and efficiency of Ram. Over 10,000 pounds of towing capacity beating to the sound of 395 horses. Let Mike Sorensen and Ram brand manager Steve Anilek prove to you it's better at Bettenhausen. Or shop online at BettenhausenAuto.com. It's better at Bettenhausen. The best braided line just got even better. Introducing Max Quattro by PowerPro. Utilizing the latest Spectra 4 carrier fiber technology, the new Max Quattro braided performance lines are engineered to be 25% thinner. With the same durability and strength you've come to expect from PowerPro. Achieve longer casting distance, greater accuracy, and improved lure movement with even better, softer, and suppler feel. Increase line capacity on any reel. Add versatility to get the competitive edge when you need it most. Power Pro Max Quattro cuts through water and thick cover better than ever. From salt water to fresh water, Power Pro Max Quattro performs without compromise. Available in proven moss green and high vis yellow in 50, 65, 80, and 100 pound strengths. For more information, visit PowerPro.com. Sing like the whole city go against me Every time I'm in the street I hear rock, rock, rock,
session, baby. baby. That's how we do it. Better one. Pull up 59 degrees, first time of the year out. Gotta love it. So far, I'm loving long way. I think it's a fish, I'm not sure. Yep. Another pretty decent one. Ooh, this guy actually got him on the top of the head. He was swatting at it. It's another nice one, 15, 16 inches. Uh, caught on the rattle bait, it's a jackal. TN70, let this dude go. What we've got here is just scattered weeds all throughout and these fish are coming in to spawn. And I'm getting them as they do that. Hopefully we'll get into an area where there's a bunch of them. But so far caught a few. Here's one. Decent fish up on the seawall. This is one looking to spawn. Come on, dude. Here's some pretty good fish. Not bad for our first time in Long Lake, first trip of the year. Beautiful. So far, the two things I've had going is throwing that little rattling bait, that little uh, jackal TN and uh, skipping or flipping this worm around some of these seawalls. The first couple of fish we caught were smaller. They seem to be getting a little bigger, which is typical this time of year. So hopefully they'll keep growing for us. Another. on the road from that last one. Another one on the little wacky rig worm. This one's probably just barely legal, but makes it. That was like two casts from that last one I just caught. And you would think there's enough seawall here. This one's got a little depth on it. It's actually about three feet there. Perfect place to spawn. Where is it? name helping anglers unlock the water's hidden secrets. Hit the switch. It's time to reveal even more. Auto Chart Live gives you the power to build your own high definition maps anywhere in the world in real time.
Because when you know the unknown, you can do the unheard of. Auto Chart Live, only with Onyx, only from Humminbird. Racing DNA, it's in our blood and in the lines of all of our legendary Mopar vehicles. And you'll find the best quality pricing and service only at the equally legendary Bettenhausen Dodge Ram Chrysler Jeep in Tinley Park. When has 707 horsepower ever been too much? Never. We don't apologize for our commitment to speed, performance, and technology. And we laugh when someone says the word average. It's better at Bettenhausen. Shop online at BettenhausenAuto.com. We tried beating it senseless, bending it in half, and punishing it with extreme temps, corrosive salt water, and blistering UV rays. And all Talon did was ask for more. So we wanted to know what Talon's breaking point really was. We'll let you know if we ever find it. Talon, born tough, tested tougher. Aerial Valley with Jack Lures here. I'm, uh, I'm at ICAST 2015 and we're introducing a couple new lures. And one of the lures is this, the Pompadour Junior. Now we released some Pompadour in ICAST last year and it was, it was a successful hit. Um, top selling top water bait and so we decided to downsize this. Perfect for smallmouth bass, you know, smaller profile, six different colors. And in fact, we released a brand new color just for the Pompadour Junior size. This is our IS Bloody Cord. It will be available. Um, early August, make sure you order them fast before they sell out. He's fished here for decades. He knows every hump, every drop off, every contour. He's dedicated his entire life to understanding this single body of water. And he didn't know squat about it until two hours ago. Auto Chart Live lets you build your own high definition maps anywhere in the world in real time. Only with Onyx. Only from Humminbird. We're here today. It's actually the middle of April. Uh, water temp when we launched the boat was about 57, 58 degrees. It's up peaking over 60 now. The fish definitely are pre-spawn. I, I didn't see a single fish on a bed, but they're close. Uh, a lot of the fish we caught were shallow. I would bet within the next week or two they're going to be they're going to be up on beds. Uh, the day was nice, uh, 60s, you know, in the 60 degree range. No rain. Uh, a big front expected tonight, and then rain tomorrow. Uh, so tomorrow might not be the best day to come out, but we were here today and it, it worked. But there's one, one, two, three, four, five boats fishing up in this corner, and I don't know if they're just lazy and want to get out of the wind, or if it's worth it. Little one. Just a little bitty dude. We're looking for his grandma. Just another good one. Switched up drone. Ooh, I got him in the side. I'm gonna flip him in here, but we might not get him. There we go. Switched up drone the jerk bait, the little squad minnow. A lot of times they just kind of take a whack at it. That's what he must have done. This has turned out to be a decent day. It's, I've only been on this lake for three hours. 
we've run into a bunch of friends here that are really whacking them, bigger fish too. I mean, we've heard of stories about threes and fours and fives being caught, and we haven't gotten anything that size, but we're working on it. Got plenty of time, we'll get there. It was, it was sitting dead in the water and one hit it. Here's one. Not a giant little dude. In fact, he's fighting way bigger than he is. Picked up a chatterbait and I'm throwing it along some of these windy seawalls and this guy hit. He's just a baby. My buddy Ray here with the camera just caught a giant that we didn't get on film, but I'm going to try and top him. <laughs> but there are some good fish here. We've talked to some of the tournament guys and they're talking about in the live wells having threes, fours, fives, and even sixes. I guess we're going to find out. Since 1991, the Corrado has been a benchmark among low-profile bait casting reels. Corrado has evolved with new Shimano design concepts and technology. Now, from Shimano, you get more with the new Corrado I-Series of casting reels only from Shimano. S3D, Shimano Stable Spool Design. x ship cutting-edge technology for gear smoothness and durability. More than 20 years of innovation. Corrado, continuing its reign as the go-to bait casting reel among avid anglers. To learn more, visit fish.shimano.com. Alex Davis here, FLW Tour Pro at the Jackal Booth at ICAST 2015. We're going to talk about two new baits. One's the Chunk Crawl. We have a three and a half inch version and a four inch version. This bait's going to be super versatile. You can use the big one on a big jig trailer, football head jig. You can use this one as a small jig trailer. You'll be able to flip this thing, throw it to Texas rig, you can Carolina rig it. Really excited about it. It has eight different colors. We tried beating it senseless, bending it in half, and punishing it with extreme temps, corrosive salt water, and blistering UV rays. And all Talon did was ask for more. So we wanted to know what Talon's breaking point really was. We'll let you know if we ever find it. Talon, born tough, tested tougher. Most of the fish we caught today were on just a couple baits. Uh, the number one was a Jackal TN70, uh, which is a vibrating lipless crankbait, uh, just kind of ripping it over and through the weeds. I used a gold color today, that seemed to show up real well. Uh, besides that, I used some plastics on seawalls. I caught a fish on a spinnerbait, uh, a couple on chatterbaits, uh, one on a jerkbait. Uh, but that TN70 seemed to be the ticket today. Now in a week when they get, they get up on beds, it'll be a whole different deal. Uh, flick shakes and stuff shallow would probably be the way to go. Uh, but today the TN70 worked.
one. Not a big one. That's a baby. Just a little baby, but they gotta live here too. I guess that's what makes it a good lake. They all grow up. Well, today we came out for our first filming trip of the year. Uh, we went to Long Lake, which is up in Lake County, Illinois, not far from Chicago, just about an hour north. Uh, had never seen the lake before we put the boat in this morning. Uh, Long Lake actually connects to the Fox Chain Lake by Squaw Creek, uh, but there is a lock that you can't just go through. Uh, I had heard that this was a pretty good lake and from others that had fished it, we decided to give it a try and we actually had a pretty decent day. Uh, there was a tournament out here today and a tournament with a bunch of my buddies and a lot of fish in the two, three, four, five, and we heard a one six, I, we haven't seen it, uh, but they have been caught. We caught probably a dozen, uh, most of them small, you know, 12 to 15, 16 inches. Uh, my partner Ray here did get one, probably four and a half pounds. My biggest one was maybe two and a half, three. Uh, but a great little lake, real weedy, supposed to be good all season long. For a lake that's close to Chicago, I'd recommend it because uh, there seems to be a pretty healthy population of fish here and not a lot of fishermen.